Rise and shine, Chicago. This one's all about the most important meal of the day. I'm making my own stuff hungry right now. <laughs> Brittany's baking up a mysterious pastry in Wicker Park. It's amazing, it's really delicious. It has a lot of flavors. Um, Croissants. Close. Uh-huh. But no. Okay. <laughs> I'm working up a sweat at a diner in River Grove. All right, morning, folks. What do you want? Come on, I haven't got all day. Actually, I'm not even going to bother asking you. You get what I give you. <laughs> and everyone's getting a little freaky in North Center. You guys are into weird stuff. You can do whatever you want to do. <laughs> if you want to play the biscuit man in the bedroom, that's all cool. Start your day the right way. I got my fork and knife. I'm ready to dig in. Chicago's best breakfast starts now. Chicago's best. We're on a mission to find Chicago's best food. Juicy, tender. Mm -mm -mm. Good eats right there. Oh, y'all. This is your show. It's the best because I say it's the best. The best. You know what to do. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Christian on Facebook. Tessa, send us here. Good food, good people. You can't find better than that. Hope you're hungry. Chicago's best, baby. The best. There's no comparison. It's Chicago's best. Starts now. For me, breakfast is best served warm and flaky. But sometimes I need a little bit more than just a croissant. So I'm headed to Alliance Bakery for a taste of a French pastry I bet you've never heard of. So Peter, so excited to be here at Alliance Bakery. First you walk in and the smell is like, like this is the way you want to start your day out. I am currently the fourth owner of Alliance Bakery. Same location since 1923. We have a wide variety of morning pastries from cinnamon rolls, scones, muffins, amazing croissants, and the one breakfast pastry that you're here for, which is the Queen Amon. What is a Queen Amon? What is a Queen Amon? What do you think a Queen Amon is? I don't know. <laughs> It's a delicious, um, uh, uh <laughs> Queen of Mine. It's like Italian almost. It must be French. Probably is something kind of flaky underneath some jelly. Probably maybe breakfast. Uh -huh. It's amazing. It's really delicious. It has a lot of flavors. Um, croissants. Close. Uh huh. But no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's kind of like a croissant, but not. It's a laminated dough, which means dough with butter in the middle, and then folded, and then folded, and folded again. And then we fill it with a raspberry compote. You had me at dough and butter. To me, <laughs> that is the key to any breakfast pastry. If it's got that in it, I'm sold. So we are going to make our Queen Amat. Queen B is gonna make the Queen of Mine. There you go. <laughs> so you've got the dough already made. So now we've got to flour the sheet here a little bit, like throw a little flour on there. Oh, that's nice. That was that's good. nice. That yeah, was nice. Go. I feel like LeBron. <laughs> the sheeter helps evenly roll out our dough. After a few passes through, okay. like this machine, I gotta get me one of these. Yeah, get one. They're only $8,000. <laughs> <so. laughs> oh, not bad, not bad. <laughs> We're ready to layer on the butter. All right, you, you wanna go for it? You get one shot. Do, 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 you do, ready? Do, 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 do. Here we go. One, two, three. That's pretty good. No, not that's, bad? No, that's not bad. <laughs> we cover our butter and the lamination process begins. In between folds, we dust with granulated sugar. Flip and turn the dough, and finally, cut into squares. So right. now, here we have fresh raspberries cooked down with a little bit of sugar and lemon juice. Yeah. We're gonna take a scoop of this, put them right, right in the middle, take one corner and another corner, and we make these little bundles. Aww. While my Queen Amon heads to the oven, I'm headed to the breakfast table. Well, Peter, I think I did a pretty great job well, you, with this. You did a fantastic job. I yeah. usually say, uh, oh, baking's not my thing, but I could come bake here. Let's, let's start part-time and see how you like it. <laughs> yeah. so we'll see. Rocky, among so many others, said that you have the best pastries in the city. So I'm excited to dig in and find out if they're right. Let's go. I love a croissant. So this takes that, but adds more of that sweetness to it. It's still that buttery, flaky, and that raspberry filling is perfection. This is totally app-worthy, but you can see I kind of went to town on mine. So Jason, can I get another one? Thank you. 